Okay, so Justin BlackRock CEO Larry Fink says FTX failed due to FTT token. That's what the BlackRock CEO says. Um, let's break this down, and I I, I kind of agree. I got some. I can see what he's getting at. Let's just say that. Let's go ahead and break this down right now. My name is Adam Shelton, and thank you for watching this video today. And you are watching the Clear Crypto YouTube channel. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Now, he does got some points what he's saying here. The CEO of BlackRock. Now, the asset manager BlackRock, which is one of the biggest name associated, okay, uh, with the investment in bankrupt crypto exchange FTX. And the latest, Larry Fink, the chairman and CEO of BlackRock made some interesting comments on the Sam Bankman fried crypto empire collapse. Now he's saying that BlackRock had a $24 million investment inside FTX, which filed for bankruptcy earlier in November. Now the crypto exchange faced a significant liquidity crunch linked to, let's just say some not good stuff. Um, diversion of user funds to other companies owned by Sam Bankman fried. FTX failed because it created its own token. I do have some agreement with that. FTX was doing fine. You know, it seemed like before the bank, Sam Bakeman Fred, it seemed like they were moving fine, but there was a lot of problems behind the scenes. Now, FTX usually will get 100% of their money back. That's what Sam Bakeman Fried says. These comments from the BlackRock CEO assume huge prominence as an asset manager is the largest such company in the world. Now, early in August, the company launched a spot Bitcoin private trust. But at the time, BlackRock said it saw a substantial interest from institutional clients from crypto integration. Ah, oh, that is interesting. Now, will he go to jail? Sam Bakeman Fry, that's what SBF stand for in terms of the initials. As FTX steers through the bankruptcy proceeding, ongoing investigations are focusing on whether the user funds are mishandled. And you know there's been some funds mishandled. You know. Meanwhile, a section of the crypto community is wondering as to how SBF, Sam Bankman Fraud, is roaming around freely after committing fraud. So he is running around free, talking to people, whatever. Many investors are wondering when SBF will be arrested. The U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission, SEC, is looking into potential diversion of funds from FTX user, U.S. user. Now, did they fail because they created this FTT token? It did not go very well, according to some of the information I was gathering, but there was a lot of mishandling behind the scenes, and I do hope everybody get their money back because this was awful, and it's cryptocurrency as a market really took it on the chin when this happened. But I do look for cryptocurrency to rebound and thrive in the future. My name is Adam Shelton, and thank you for watching this video today. And you are watching the Clear Crypto YouTube channel. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and uh, I'll see you on the next video. Cryptocurrency is not dead. It's going to be just fine.